This is not the end. This is just the beginning. Four members of the Louisville 87 joined the Kentucky Alliance Against Racist and Political Repression at its weekly news conference. They were among the 87 protesters arrested on Attorney General Daniel Cameron's lawn Tuesday. We are tired. We have been marching, we have been chanting, we have been on the streets, and we are angry. Enough is enough. It is time to do something now. All 87 were initially given a felony charge of intimidating a participant in a legal process for the demands made towards Cameron regarding the Breonna Taylor investigation. It was later dropped, although they still face misdemeanor charges. We are sick and tired of waiting. We need justice for Breonna Taylor. The Alliance also reacted to comments a Conway Middle School special education teacher made on a Facebook post referring to protesters saying, quote, kill them all. And her response was full speed ahead. Don't worry, they'll blend in with the pavement. Tyra Walker is co-chair of the Kentucky Alliance and secretary of the Jefferson County Teachers Association. I am also on the Racial Equity Policy Advisory Council. And if we're trying to close the achievement gap, we cannot have teachers like this at Jefferson County Public Schools. So it's time to get rid of them. JCPS says it's looking into comments made, but Walker says she's going to personally see that it's handled. You cannot teach our kids when you have an attitude or you think like this about our baby. Despite Facebook backlash and the recent arrests, protesters say they have no plans to stop. We're going to continue to do this for Breonna Taylor. We're going to continue to do this for George Floyd. We're going to continue to do this for all that have been faced with police brutality. Drew Gardner, 